Hey guys, it's me. Welcome back to another video. And today I am at the barn. Yay! And I'm doing another vlog. So yay. Um, today we're, I'm going to be jumping him bareback because my mom wants to learn. So I'm going to teach my mom. And I, I've never jumped him bareback. So this is going to be my first time and her first time. Um, this is going to be interesting. Uh, today I'm just wearing my tank, a horse tank top, my Tough Rider Hunter Green pants, and my Nova Outfitter socks with my boots. And I'm using, right now I'm just using this halter, whole rope halter. So yeah, I'm going to go get him and then I'm going to go um, groom him and then bridle him. And then yeah, I'm going to go do some jumping on bareback. And then after that, I'm going to go over the barrel pattern with him because Nationals is in July and my mom wants to do a barrel race on him for cancer. So yeah, that's going to happen. So I'm going to start teaching him now so he can be good at Nationals. So yeah, here we so go. I just finished grooming him and I totally forgot to film it, so I'm sorry. But um, yeah, he looks really good in that color. It's like neon green, but he looks really good in it. Um, never, probably not gonna use it though, just as a halter because I just don't like bright colors. I don't like bright colors like on for saddle pads and stuff. Don't you do that again. Ow, he just bit me. Do you see that? <laughs> Bite me again, I dare you. Anyways, like I was saying before I rudely got bitten, <laughs> I don't know what I was saying. Um, it hurt. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'll probably never use it as a saddle pad color. Because I just don't like bright colors. I think he got angry because I wouldn't let him eat grass, so he resided to biting me. He hasn't bit me forever. He's like. Jeez, boy, I'm gonna murder you. I'm like, I figured we were done with biting, but uh, apparently not. He hasn't bitten me in like months because I've been training him not to bite people because that's not the right thing to do, you know? Here he comes, biting me on camera as normal. Little turd nugget. Ugh, horses, that's all I gotta say. But yeah. He was, could you not? He was the first horse. Here, let's talk about biting for a second. If your horse bites you, get on. Make that a problem. Like get onto your horse. Like all I did was like fling the rope really hard and he backs up. That shows that he does not need to do that. See, now he's being a good boy. He may be a little angry, but he's being good. So yeah. Discipline your horse if they do something wrong. You don't want your horse being this biting horse that like kills everyone. So, yeah. Okay, now I'm gonna be done ranting about biting and <laughs> go lunch him, cause he, maybe. He, you know what, should I lunge you today? Yes, yes I shall. So, yeah, I'm gonna go lunch him and then I'll be getting his bridle and then we're gonna be riding him there back. So yeah. Today is going to be a fun day. Hope you enjoy. Lunging him, and now I'm just gonna go ride him bareback and set up some jumps. And yeah, <sighs> yeah, here we go. I'm gonna die. Pray for me. <laughs>
did some bareback riding on him and jumping, and then he got a little mad and started bucking and stuff, so now I'm just doing groundwork with him. So yeah, he's not a happy camper right now because I'm doing groundwork with him. So yeah. I am now done doing groundwork with him. And I finally, like for the first time on him, I did a leg up, well not like, I did the swing leg mount thing on bareback, whatever you call that. I don't know. I did it on him. I'm super excited. It only took me like five minutes. But like, I'm so happy because I did it. Cause that's my first time ever doing it. It's really hard. Uh, so I'll show a video of me doing that in the uh in the video <laughs> and overall he was really good besides when i got on him and he started bucking so that's the first time he's ever he has ever bucked like since i've owned him like it was weird <laughs> and he just got like super mad i don't know why all of a sudden so then we stopped jumping and we did flat work we did downward transitions and everything Get his mind thinking again, and then we jumped one more time, and we did good. Yeah. Yeah. Today was hard for him. Hard for me, because I did bareback, and my legs are going to be hurting tomorrow. They're already sore. They're going to be even more sore tomorrow. So, yeah, that's going to be great. Um, ow. I'm trying to think of anything else. We did... Yeah, there's nothing really else we did. We just, I lunged him, um, then I jumped him on bareback, and then I rode him bareback some more. Then I did some groundwork, and then I got, I jumped up on him bareback too. So pretty much it was just no sad all day. By the time no stirrup November comes, I'm gonna be all ready for, I'm gonna be ready for it. My legs are gonna be nice and strong. I'm sorry, I'm like out of breath. Like literally can't talk. I'm doing the equestrian workout for October. For no to get ready for no stirp november so like my legs they're like <laughs> they're like getting strong but they're also getting sore because <laughs> riding and that it's like killing my legs but it's gonna be worth it because i'll be ready for no stirp november because my trainer fully believes in that help me <laughs> but yeah leave that in the comment section y'all if y'all do no stirp november because that'd be cool um i think that's it i'm just gonna go feed him now and Pulling him out. Yeah. Then our day's gonna be over. Then I have school tomorrow. And he has to get his shots tomorrow. So I may vlog that. Hmm. I'm depending nah. I was gonna think put those in this vlog, but it's fine. I'll just make another vlog for McCoy getting his shots done. Whatever. Clip break. <laughs> I'm kidding. But yeah, I'm just gonna go feed him now and I will see y'all there. Just let him out and that's gonna be the end of today's vlog. So I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you next time and peace the heck out and goodbye.